Hi everybody, I'm Philip Goodman from the Drewsdale Real Estate Group at Keller Williams Group One Inc. in Reno, Nevada. I'm here today with Sabrina Karstensen, our Minden Gardnerville Topaz expert. How have you been, Sabrina? I'm great, Philip. How about you? I've been well too. Good to see you again. It's been a month since our last report. Yeah. And since it has been a month since our last report and the, well, for the most part, the busy selling season of July, August, September has come to a close, we're gonna take a look back at what happened in the third quarter in the Minden Gardnerville area and compare that to the 2017 number. So for that, let's go right into the multiple listing service. Here we are inside the multiple listing service and Sabrina and I have already input the parameters for the data that we want here. On the top, we've got the 2018 numbers showing 244 sold units. And on the bottom part here, we've got the 2017 activity. Sabrina, take it away. The exciting thing about this third quarter that I wanted to share with you was that on average, sellers were receiving 99% of their asking price with a small percentage of the sellers receiving over their asking price. So there were a few properties where they asked a lot and they actually got a lot more, but then there were a few properties where they asked a lot and got a little bit less. Absolutely. Sabrina, let's talk about the days on market in 2018 versus days on market in 2017. What do you see here? 2017 third quarter average days on market is 106, whereas this year's third quarter average days on market is only 81. So even though prices are going up, properties are still selling faster. Isn't that amazing? Well, now that we've taken a look at what has happened in the third quarter of this year, let's look at what properties are still on the market and what could happen for the fourth quarter finishing 2018. For that, let's go back inside MLS. Sabrina, we're looking at the list of active properties in the Minden Gardnerville Topaz area, 294 of them right now, but some of them are active pending a loan, pending uh, house, why is it still important for buyers to consider these properties? That is a great question. There's a lot of different variables which could cause the deal to fall through, which would put the property back on the market. So even though it says pending a loan, someone should still give you a call and say, hey, what's the story? Is the, is the buyer going to perform? And you can call the agent and ask those questions. Yes, please. <laughs> Here we are on our website, crenohomesforsale.com, and today's featured property is 1449 Patricia Ave in Gardnerville. Sabrina, what can you tell us about this? This four-bed, two-and-a-half bath home was recently remodeled and updated to include granite kitchen countertops, and this property sits on just under a quarter acre. Check out these hardwood floors. Wow. Look at that staining on that cabinetry. Mm-hmm and big open sky and most of these properties in Gardnerville are going to have a view of the Sierras yeah most of them yes excellent excellent well for more information about this property log on to crenohomesforsale.com or you can call Sabrina at the info you see on your screen now well there is your third quarter update for the Minden Gardnerville Topaz area Halloween is right around the corner what's happening down in Gardnerville for Halloween we have Corley Ranch which is a family run and owned business off 395 uh, there's vendor booths, wagon rides, pumpkin art, um, there's corn mazes, there's goats, there's pigs. There's a lot of fun. There's a lot of fun. What are you going to be this year for Halloween? A mom. A mom. <laughs> you, but you're that every day and good at it. <laughs> for more information about the numbers that we've discussed today, or if you're ready to go look at any of the properties from our website, crenohomesforsale.com, you can contact Sabrina at the information you see on your screen now. If you found this information helpful, please give it a like and a share on your social media too. For Sabrina Karstensen, for the Drewsdale Real Estate Group at Keller Williams Group One Inc. in Reno, Nevada, I'm Philip Goodman. We'll see you next time. Bye. This four bedroom, two and a half bath home was recently remodeled and updated to include a granite countertop in the kitchen. <laughs> how many how many kitchen counters does it come with? Just one. one. <laughs> or at least one updated one. Right? The rest are still laminate. Yeah. yeah. All right. Korean. Uh, okay. Three, two, one.